policy autonomous threat prevention. By the end of this training, you'll be able to enable autonomous threat prevention, install the TP policy, and change the policy. The new autonomous threat prevention management is a whole new way to manage your threat prevention security gateways. Single click configuration. The administrator just needs to choose one of the predefined types of networks for the security gateways to protect. Automatic configuration updates. Checkpoint automatically updates the profile and the customers automatically enjoy new features, advanced protections and more. Streamlines configuration and deployment of policy profiles across your security gateways. It provides a simple and powerful customization to serve your organization's needs. Zero day-to-day -day maintenance required from the administrator while maintaining optimal security. These are the profiles you can select for your gateway, so either perimeter, internal network, guest network, strict security, or cloud data center. This new feature is amazing for customers who don't have the time to handle threat prevention configurations, customers who do not know how to configure threat prevention and want to be more secured, customers who would like their threat prevention configuration to always be up to date. In order to do this demo, of course you'll need smart console access, be aware of your organizational needs, and make sure you have the right license. This is Smart Console. I'm going to go to the Gateway object, Threat Prevention, and I'm going to enable the Autonomous Threat Prevention. Press OK. Next, I'll need to go to the Policy and enable Threat Prevention. Here from the autonomous policy, I can see the current one is perimeter. I can go ahead and modify it if I want to. I'm going to stay with perimeter network. Now, I've made a small change here. I've added uh, content awareness blade and I've added this rule to drop PCI credit card number. So if someone's going to send out that information, we'll be able to drop it. And now I can go ahead and install the policy. I'm selecting my new full protection policy with access control and threat prevention. Press install. I'm changing the previous policy that I had and that's okay. Okay, policy installation was successful. Now I'm going to run a small test just to see how secure I really am. I'm using the check me service, network protection. I've read and agreed, and I'm going to check my security status. And look, no potential threats were found during the check me assessment. I'm protected on all the levels. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.